Hello everyone, this is John again. Uh, today we're gonna learn tip 16 identical equation, okay? So uh, you have to figure out the difference. What is the identical equation and what is the algebra equation, okay? Identical equation is one special type of algebra equations uh, because that equation is uh, always true, okay? Uh, for all values, all values of right variables. Okay, when you uh, plug in any number for the variable, it is always true. That means the identical equation have infinitely many solutions. That is correct, right? Uh, the other one is uh, the expressions for both sides must be equal. When you plug in any number of variables, it is always true. So you have to remember these two properties. Uh, now we're going to have uh, some examples, okay? So example one, uh, equals, okay, 2x plus 5 equals ax plus b for all value of x, okay? So the equation is true. Uh, for all value of x, when you plug in any number in x, Okay, it is always true, right? So that means uh, the, the equation is identical. So both sides of the identical equation must be equal, right? Coefficient of this corresponding term should be equal, right? So a is two, b is five, okay? So example two, the next one. If ax squared plus bx plus c is zero is true for all value of x. Uh, that means uh, this equation is the identical equation, right? Okay. Uh, now check uh, their expressions. One side is zero. That means zero x squared plus zero x plus zero. That's why they all got zero, okay? So ax squared plus bx plus c equal to this zero x squared plus zero x plus zero, right? So uh, a is zero, b is zero, and also c is zero, okay? Because it is identical equation, okay? Now we have some uh, SAT equations. Okay, where is it? Okay, number one here, okay? Okay, number one, if uh, x times k minus is zero for all values of x, so what is the value of k? Uh, right, uh, so both sides express must be equal, right, because it is identical. I'm going to change the form. k minus 2 times x equals zero means uh, zero x, okay, zero equals zero x. So the coefficient of x should be equal to zero, right, so k minus 2 is zero. Okay, so now we can see the value of k is 2, right? The choice B is the answer. Okay, number 2. Try the number 2. Okay, x squared plus bx plus c is true for all x. That means it is identical equation, okay? Now change the form, okay? Uh, this is 0 is what? 0 x squared plus bx, uh, zero x plus zero, right? That's the meaning. Okay, so coefficient of each, each variable must be equal, right? So it's zero, b is zero, c equals zero, okay? So sum of all three numbers is zero. It's okay? Okay, so choice A is the answer, okay? Now let's go to number three. Okay, here is number three. Okay, in the equation above, k and a are constant. Right, okay, so uh, x is a variable, okay. Uh, the equation is true for all x. It is unidentical, right? So just compare their coefficient, okay? Now let's see. Mm. Coefficient must be equal, that means k plus one is a, and constant term, uh, five equals, mm, okay. 5 equals k, right? That's constant term, okay? So what is the value of a? 
Okay, so the value of a equals y k plus one, right? Well, now we know that uh, the value of k is five. Okay, so a equals what is it? A equals k plus one equals k is five. Okay, so five plus one is six is the answer. Okay, very good. Okay, now the last question is number four. In the question above, uh, the equation is above. Okay, uh, a and b are constant. Okay, if the equation is true for all value of x, okay, for all value of x, so what is the value of a? So now we know that, right, the equation is identical, right? Okay, a, okay, uh, ax plus a plus uh, bx minus b equals, uh, uh, okay, 2x plus 1. So we combine this, okay, ax, bx, a plus b times x and constant term a minus b goes uh, it is 2x plus 4 right okay both sides are identical now the coefficient is equal so a plus b is 2 a minus b is 4 right okay so when you the additions, so b is cross out two times a equals two plus four is six. Okay, from here the value of a is what three. Okay, so choice three is the answer. Okay, all right, we need to memorize. Okay, oh, we are just memorize the properties of identical equation. Okay, all right, that's all today. I'll see you next time. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye everybody. Bye bye.